What's up, you guys? This is Karmic Endings, TNTN, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of, or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangel, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel these current karmic messages for the collective. Ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribe, the emails, the bookings, the donations. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support that you show to me in the channel. I appreciate you. And all the other information about me will be down below in the description box with the links available. All right, you guys. I appreciate you. I do. I appreciate y'all a ton. I appreciate the emails, man. I appreciate y'all so much. I really do. I really, really, really do. All right, y'all. So let's get into these messages. See what you guys should know at this time. Ancestors of the highest good, please protect me as I get into this energy. All right. Let's see. What's going on? Okay. So there's an emperor energy that wasn't expecting to see something. So there's an emperor energy that wasn't expecting to see something. Something could have like blew up in somebody's face or somebody wasn't expecting to see something. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Page of Wands. Hermit. For some of y'all, somebody feel like you did something slick uh, to get out of something. Somebody feel like you did something slick to get out of something. Somebody could have wanted you to be in a fucked up situation, but they feel like you got away with something. <laughs> okay, I don't know. That's what I'm seeing and hearing. You got Virgo, Aries, Gemini, Taurus, or a Sagittarius. So this is somebody that tried to get you caught up in a situation, but you could have, they feel like you did something specific to get out of it. For some of y'all, this is somebody, this your baby daddy. For others of you, this is like uh, some kind of male friend. So like if you a guy watching me, this is like a hating ass male friend of yours. This is like an ex male friend. Somebody could have tried to get you caught up in a situation, but they feel like you, you slid out of something. Or it's like somebody was really banking on something happening to you or something, but it didn't happen. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> What's going on, Spirit? Y'all got somebody hot. That's how I feel. Y'all got somebody hot. <laughs> this is giving me kind of energy like you outsmarted somebody. That's the energy I'm feeling, like you outsmarted someone. <laughs> and this person is, is, you know, they feel in some kind of way. Yeah, you got Queen of Cups. And you got the Ten of Wands. Ten of Pentacles. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. So somebody felt like you could have got into a position where it was real heavy on you, right? It, it was heavy or something like that. Or somebody thought something was heavy on you. And then you could have bust up with the Ten of Pentacles kind of energy, or you could have came up with the Ten of Pentacles, or you could have figured out a way out of a situation. <laughs> and somebody like, what the fuck? Yeah, Six of Cups in the Hierophant. It's like you figured your way out of something. For some of y'all, this could be somebody, this could be a man, or, for, or whoever this emperor energy is, they could have wanted you like, poor or defeated in some shape or form and this is giving me an energy where for some of y'all you you could have started a business and got some money i mean shit this could be lottery this could be fucking somebody just giving you money or this is like some kind of resource that you could have had to help you get a situation that you needed and whoever this emperor energy is this person mad as fuck because somebody wanted you stressed, depressed, broke, frustrated, all kind of shit. 
Somebody really wanted you fucked up. They did. They did. Some do it a cancer. You could be a cancer. Sagittarius, Virgo, Scorpio, or Taurus. Yep, somebody wanted you fucked up. That's what I'm seeing. They did. But it turned around. Yeah. And you got your power back. Or this is what's going to happen. So if you are in the Ten of Wands right now, be looking forward to this Ten of Pentacles. Because it's coming to you. And it's going to help you get back on your feet in some kind of way. You know what I'm saying? How to divine work. Okay, I'm hearing divine say, let us surprise you. Let us surprise you. Okay? Because something is coming. And it's going to help you in a situation. Okay? For some of y'all, you could be wanting to move back to your, to your hometown or something. Somebody could be trying to move back. I'm hearing their hometown and there is some money that's coming in. It's a lot of money too. This could be like a resource. Like like some, like some there's a resource coming in. Okay, that's going to help you. For some of y'all, if this is not you moving back to your hometown, this is a resource that's coming. It's like wherever you live, there's a resource that's going to help you get all this money wherever you live. And it's going to be connected to somebody that has some kind of like, they got some kind of resources that can get you something. You know what I'm saying? Yup. I can't, I can't make it up. I split the deck on the Ten of Pentacles again. And then you got, look at this, four of swords. And then you got that, that strength card right there. Because I feel like whatever this money that's coming in, you're going to be very, it's going to, whatever this resource that, that's about to come through, you're going to be able to relax. That's what that four of swords is because it's like something gonna come through so good that it's like you're gonna be chill. Like you ain't gonna have to worry about shit. Like you're gonna be like shit. You know, I'ma just chill. <laughs> you know? Like even if you still work, you're not gonna be stressing hard. You're not gonna be trying to overdo it or exert yourself. You're gonna be chilling. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You're gonna be like, well shit. I ain't, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh boy, I love it when it works out like that. Motherfuckers be thinking that they got you in a fucked up position and you bounce back like, ah, bitch, what you thought? <laughs> oh, they be thinking they be having you all stressed and shit. Yeah, I got that bitch stressed. And then you just bust out with some shit. Like, ah, pot out, ho. <laughs> Uh, life path number five, life path number eight. Somebody could have been born on the fifth of the month, the tenth, or the eighth. All right. What's this Queen of Cups? What's this Queen of Cups? Yeah. That one is going to reverse, so I'm going to turn it. Four of Cups in the reverse. Yeah. Whoever this person is, I feel like that they were very content on how something was going. But somebody is going to be very shocked how something is going to come for you. I'm talking about shocked as hell. I'm talking about shocked as fuck. For some of y'all, this could be a collaboration with somebody. If you single, this could be somebody that you're going to meet. And they're going to be like very, very, very successful. And this person may spoil the fuck out of you. To the point where all the money you make, you could keep to yourself. You could do what you want with your money. But then you may get with somebody that's very, very well off that may take care of you or some shit. Okay, this could be that too. What's the Ten of Wands? This funny. Ten of Wands. People be commenting like, nah, that ain't funny. Yes, the fuck it is. And I'm going to laugh again. <laughs> Because it is funny. I'm going to laugh as much as I fucking want. Don't watch me then. The fuck? Ten of Wands. What's the Ten of Wands? Nine of Swords and the world. Yeah, it's an ending to burdens. So if you've been like very burdened, it's an end to that. Something to do with a Sagittarius or a Gemini. Yep, it's an ending to that. And you about to see too. What's the Ten of Pentacles? 
What's the Ten of Pentacles? Yeah, Two of Wands. For some of y'all, whatever choice that you about to make, whatever path that you about to make, you about to choose, whoever you about to choose to link up with or whatever, this is gonna, this is gonna set you. When I say, man, you're gonna be so fucking comfortable, yo. You're not gonna have to worry or stress so hard. Okay? Or like be so burdened where you got so much on you or some shit. Okay? That's awesome energy. What's the Six of Cups? For some of y'all, this is a person you got kids with. Queen of Cups. Yeah. For some of y'all, you do got children with whoever this person is that was trying to fuck you up. Okay, for some of y'all, they could have had whoever that they are partnered up with. Like if they in some kind of relationship or marriage. This person could have had the person that they was with to team up with too to come up against you. You know, to really try to make you burden and shit. You know, to really take your power or stress you out. You know, and all of that. But something is going to turn around. It's about to turn around. What's the Hierophant? If this is like a couple, like let's say this is like your baby daddy and, and whoever that they with, whoever that they with, this person do not like you. When I say they hate you, they hate you. They hate you more than this baby daddy do. It's like whoever this woman is, this person could be trying, this person could give this man ideas about how to try to fuck you up and shit. Like what to do, how to do it and all of that. <laughs> What's the horrifying? This fucked up. I can't make it up. The Will of Fortune and the Four of Pentacles. Somebody was trying to purposely hold something back so you would be fucked up. Somebody could have hit up. I mean, if this is magic that somebody was doing, they, they did hit up somebody powerful to do some shit to you. They did to like really hold something back when it comes to your fortune. Something that you deserve. Yeah, they did. This is somebody that could have, if this is not magic, this is somebody that could have tried to fuck, fuck with you when it came to the government in some shape or form for some of y'all. If you got kids with this person or something, somebody tried to fuck you up as far as the government. Somebody wanted something held back from you so you would be fucked up. Yep. What's the Will of Fortune? Five of Cups in the reverse. Yep, we got the King of Wands. Wherever this person is, they don't have they they don't have no emotion when it comes to you. Like like they don't give a fuck about you. They really don't. Like on a heart level, they don't care. Okay, this person was very happy to do what they was doing. This person was very happy to know that you were stressed out about something, that something was weighing heavy on you. You know what I'm saying? They, this person was happy as fuck to know. Yeah, they were. They were. They were happy to know that. Very. But whoever this person is, they about to be mad as hell about what's coming in because this person is not gonna expect. They're not going to expect it. If this is like court, somebody could feel like that. Oh, yeah, I know I got to win. And then something come in to where they don't win. And then they be looking like, oh, shit. I didn't see that coming. And then they over there looking at you like, what the fuck did you do? To, to get away or to get off, I'm hearing. This is somebody that will literally sacrifice themselves to get you fucked up. Like, that's how bad this person wants you fucked up. They will put themselves in a predicament, you know, a risky situation to get you fucked up. Because whoever this person is, they feel like they got power over you or they got some kind of upper hand, you know, when it comes to you. So this person feel like, if anybody gonna get out of some shit, it's gonna be them. It ain't gonna be you. But then you gonna be the one that's gonna get out of something. And this person gonna be sitting there like, damn. 
<laughs> How the fuck did you make that happen? Yeah. This person gonna realize that they was wasting time even trying to do the, the fucked up shit to you. They gonna realize that they was wasting time. Yeah. Because that bad karma, they gonna realize like, damn. I'm up under some bad karma. Like, this is somebody that it may even hit them like that. Like, damn, am I... Damn. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm really going through some bad karma. Yeah, this person gonna be creeping and shit. Watching you and shit. Yeah. Because this person gonna be needing your help. So, this is somebody that was banking on you needing them. But they gonna be needing you. <laughs> Can you put some money on my books, please? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yep, that's what's gonna happen, y'all. Yeah, that's exactly what the fuck gonna happen. And y'all gonna be like, no, no. <laughs> Figure out another way to get to get to get them money on them books. I don't know why I'm hearing money on them books. So somebody could be in jail or something like that, or they gonna end up in jail, or they gonna end up in a very stuck situation, looking dumb and shit. Yeah, this person's very bothered, very threatened. Yeah, very. Because somebody thought that they had you in a fucked up position and it ain't happening. Yeah, whoever this boss daddy is, like I said. Somebody thought that they had you in a fucked up position. Exactly. Whoever this person is, I'm hearing them say, I always get what I always get what I want. But with you, they wasn't able to get you, get you like they wanted you. This person could have tried to block your shine and, and block your hustle. This person tried to block a lot with you. Yup. This boss daddy threatened as fuck. They're threatened by you. Yup. Whoever this person is, this person, I'm feeling like whoever this person is, they don't really get threatened by people. Like, this person usually does have the upper hand with people. They usually do. But with you, it, it, didn't, it didn't work out that way in the end. Like, this person did not have the upper hand in the end. Yeah, this person could love heels. Or somebody love heels. Yup. <laughs> Woo! This is what I'm seeing, man. Somebody is not expecting this shit, y'all. Mm -hmm. there could be an age gap in this situation oh well somebody felt like you did something slick they're like how the fuck did you get out of this and and, and now I'm in a, stuck, in a situation where now I'm stressing okay <laughs> woo Dummy. L. It's a dumbass motherfucker, I tell you. Especially what I'm feeling. Oh boy. This is crazy. I tell you. Some of the rings could be significant. Somebody love wearing a lot of rings on their fingers or something like that. All right, you got eight or a Leo or life path number eight. Flip flop lover. Somebody could be a performer. A cleansing is needed. You got hacker. Freckles. Short straight hair. You got joggers. You got Ian. Some do it a dancer. You got X con. Hex is off. Exactly. This person was not expecting this shit. Not what I'm feeling. You got lip gloss or a lip gloss line. Right arm tattoos. Some do a seven or a cancer or July. You have government. I was feeling that energy. Bands or an expensive vehicle. Yep. This person did do a hex. You got nurse. Neck tattoos, 
So I'm gonna do it a condo. Jamaican Haitian Creole. Sunglasses, somebody love wearing shades. You got cook, right-handed. Earth sign receiving bad karma, Taurus Virgo Capricorn. You got thick eyebrows, thongs, house. So I'm gonna do a three or a Pisces. You got dogs, 40s, 37 or 73. Life path number seven or life path number three. Long straight hair, Chevy, Gap teeth, Pisces, Doctor. Somebody could be real thin, real small. And I'm telling y'all some real ass shit about this. All right. You got 3883. Oh boy, oh boy. Somebody love wearing lip color or something like that. I mean, whoever this person is, somebody is learning not to judge a book off of the cover. Like, somebody could have felt like you were soft or you were naive or, you know, somebody just underestimated you. That's basically what I'm seeing. You were underestimated. And you proved that you're not somebody to play with. <laughs> That's what I'm seeing. Or this is what's about to happen. For some of y'all, if you a man and this is like a friend of yours, an old friend that tried to get you fucked up, for some of y'all, this person, if they are like married or in some kind of relationship, they did try to hit up some people to do some black magic on you, to fuck you up, to fuck up your, your business and shit like that, to make it heavy, to make you stress in, but you gonna get all the money you need, okay, in a situation. For some of y'all, this could have something to do with some kind of money that you're going to get when you go out of town or when you go back to your hometown. You may get some kind of money opportunity that's going to give you all the money you need in a situation. And whoever this person is, they're going to see that you got some kind of finances or something and they're going to be like, what the fuck? Okay, for some of y'all, this is an ex-friend of yours and their person doing like magic on you to fuck you up in your situation if you are a man okay yep mm -hmm. I heard Nathan mm -hmm. somebody could be a gambler if this emperor energy is in a relationship Whoever they in a relationship with, this person could work in a medical field. Somebody work in a medical field or somebody could work for the government, one or the other. Medical field or government. Okay? Somebody could be a bartender or a chef, or I say I was about to say chef, but something to do with a sheriff. Okay? I heard sheriff. Somebody could be a male model. Okay? I heard Nebraska, New York. Okay. I heard Naomi. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. For some of y'all, this was somebody, this was an emperor energy in their mother. Somebody in their mother could have came together towards you too. To do some fucked up shit. Mm-hmm. And whoever this mother is, this mother could work in the medical field. In some shape or form. This person do, if they, if they don't do it like every week or something like that, this person could dibble and dabble and work in like with patients and stuff. Like they could do like home care here and there or something like that. Okay. Mm-hmm. It's a false ass person. But this person is not going to believe 
They're not going to believe it. Something to do with Minneapolis. They're not going to believe it. Mm -mm. I heard Mayhem. Manhattan. Okay. I heard Maurice. I heard Milani. Milan. Mario. All right. All right, you guys. I really hope that these messages helped you or gave you some kind of clarity in your situation. All right, like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace.